both passionate about painting. Like we paint in a way very similarly. We hardly discuss it, but yet the paintings look like we've been planning them forever. It's almost like I've been waiting to be asked to do something with Sophie. It feels like we've an awful lot in common and we're chalk and cheese, I think. So sirens was the starting point. So I, I literally thought of sirens on the ambulances and sirens on the rocks luring the sailors. As I was painting it, I was sort of gathering the view and gathering the light in the space, intensifying it with the pigments of the blue sky. Worked with a lot of fluorescent blue. Even though the paintings are full of sunshine and happiness, I think there's a lot of terror. And I think it's terror because you look at them first and you see the sunshine in your paintings, but there was the bottom one and it was like, we're, there's a lot of talk about emigrants and boats and it's not just a sailing picture, it's, it looks kind of troubled. And I think for me, I was more interested in British working class culture. Margaret has a real history of that. I want people to walk between the sculptures, so like walk between the paintings. I'm very interested in scale, as Sophie is. So mine's gonna come down, I've made little things. So we're gonna have big things. Zooming down for Sophie's painting is into my sculptures and down to some small things. People kept sending me photographs of Sophie's painting through holes in my paintings. So it was just like, we kind of framed each other very differently. I mean, I've always loved Turner, so yeah. I think he's such an important artist. I put him in my painting, he's on the mast. He can take things almost to the point of destroying it. And then with just a few marks, it just lifts it, raises it up into something else. I think we might surprise people. They might actually be interested in the painting. We're thinking of our works as mirrors from the outside. We want people to just look at it and then go back outside and... Look at the world differently. Look at the world differently. Mm -hmm.